This is Setup Showcase, Episode 1. What you know about setups, Hater? This week's episode of Setup... Setup? Setup Showcase comes from Ultimate from Epic PC Game Time. And already take note that he has 5 screens, so clearly this is going to be a pretty awesome setup. Now I sent this video as a video response to my um, intro video asking about his setup, and he did his own setup video to post as a video response and post to his channel, but I'm still going to review it in my setup showcase. Alright, so his main TV is really old, as you can see. It's a box TV. He's, I think he said it has HD support, so it's one of those awkward upscaled things, but it's really not an HD TV. Might be rear projection. Whatever. Then he has a small flat screen, still standard definition, mounted to the bedpost of this bunk bed. I really like the way he's done this, um, but I'll get to that in a minute. He's got two PCs set up, one custom, one pre-built. Um, the custom is for his gaming and such, and the pre-built is for managing his live streams and things like that. And there's his Xbox. That's a really good way to do that. I usually do that with my laptop, just have one screen up for that, one screen up for the stream. Um, sure, dual monitors would help with that, but, I mean, if you're live streaming PC games, that wouldn't work. So he's got his Xbox, his snowball mic, the essential stuff, uh, Xbox controller for his PC, a uh, mouse, keyboard, nice LED backlit keyboard, nice monitor, that's the way to do it. It's an Acer monitor, but whatever. Any, um, like I said, I really like the way he has this set up under the bunk bed. Um, if I still had bunk beds, which I haven't for years, but if I did, I would set this up the, a similar way, because I really like that. Because when you're sleeping, you don't even have to necessarily deal with all the fan noise or anything like that, because it's all stowed away under your bunks. And while that takes up the majority of his room, it doesn't interfere with his sleeping, so I just really like that. And then he has a MacBook with a mouse and keyboard. Not really sure what I think about that. I'm not, I don't know why you'd put a mouse and keyboard on it, maybe a mouse, but whatever. Um, but, you know, I'm going to be anti-MacBook or whatever. But this really looks like how my old setup used to, where I had an abundance of screens and stuff. My advice, because he said he's going to be changing it soon, downgrade the amount of computers and screens a bit. I'm sure you probably never used the flat screen TV. And so, and he said he was getting a better TV. So, get a better um, HD-ish TV and get a, and just downgrade to... Maybe just the pre-built computer and your gaming computer, as well as the TV, and you should be good to go. Otherwise, an impressive setup, a bit overkill, but hey, that's what it's all about. Thank you for watching, guys. Please submit your um, setups to me via any way you can contact me, and I will be sure to review them on a future episode. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day.